resentful? Maybe I am. Am I too blunt? Maybe I am. Driven and determined. Everything I have, I worked hard for, I earned it. My upbringing was hard, I had to persevere even while hurting. But I don't have to tell you this. You are the reason why my hurt exists. You are the reason why I'm built like this. Mommy, why you didn't try harder? Why did you leave me with your mean ass mother? She treated you horrible, yet you still loved her. It's generational. Now you're sick and you want me to say something inspirational. Well, I'm still hurt. I'm still angry. Your lack of accountability truly pains me. You were the oldest of 12. You were treated poorly yourself. So why would you subject your child to that type of hell? Mommy, why you didn't try harder? Your mother doesn't want this. She cried, cried, and cried about the way you all four treat each other. You know, and her only wish is that for you all to be at peace. But that ain't gonna happen. And this is someone that has the love for God and cannot even accept peace. Exactly. All for green and money. Oh, it's going to take more than a dollar to get their horns up. You got damn right it takes more than a single dollar. It's that million dollar policy that I've been pumping all that money into that my mother's in there laying on. That's what gets me motivated. Charleston. Let them talk. Yeah, let him go ahead and speak the thoughts of all three of you. Let him go ahead and be the one to let the cat out of the bag. <laughs> oh, the cat did know. Hmm. And you've been cut out of the equation. You see, we don't possess a six-figure income like you do. But we take our little pennies, put them together, and we pay mom's life insurance every month. Do you hear yourself? I hear myself very clearly. You opted not to put a penny into mommy's insurance policy, so I hope and pray that you don't expect to get a dollar after we pay for mommy's funeral expenses. Your mother is right upstairs. You know what, you're right. Let me lower my voice. Even if she can't hear you, you're gonna go right upstairs and tell her as soon as you can. This one ain't making it back up those stairs. It's not even about lowering your voice. It's about respect, the fact that your mother is still alive. And Marie, they have half her body in the grave already. They've been plotting this heist for months. Nah, we've been planning this for years. God is answering our prayers about our mother. Maybe you haven't been praying that. Maybe you should be praying about your patterns and the way you've been living your life. Heal and shift. That's all your mother wants from you. She knows you're the connector that can bring you all together. She just wants you to use your gift. Bravo. Bravo. Raving performance. <laughs> Very well said, CNA. You hit that right on the head. Now hit the motherfucking door. Can I just say bye to your mother? Nah. We got that. We can do that for you. Emery, you're good. Okay. I know that you have our mother's best interests at heart. Trust me, Cicelyn. If I was financially okay, I would take care of your mother for free. I know, and I believe you. I just wish that they believed you. There's something I need to tell you. No, 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 you don't have to say it. You're good. Trust me, you are good. Let her leave, Cicelyn. You know what? Hmm. Me and Mommy changed her policy. Her policy is now $850,000. What the fuck? Now, of that $850,000, when she lays her head to rest, you get $500,000 $500, out of that $850,000. So now, how do you all like that? I know she did. She did what? So y'all must have forced her hand. We didn't do no such thing. And besides, we couldn't have. Mommy's wrist is too bruised and battered for somebody to take her hand and make her sign. We have a witness. So you two just, 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 just cut us down? You just practically just cut us out? Cut you out of what? So you mean to tell me that this lady walks off with $500,000 of my mother's money? That she did not put a signature policy. So all these years that I've left in my family to care for your mother is nothing. 
Aunt Marie, it doesn't mean anything to us because you chose to do that, not me. And he ain't do no $500,000 worth of goddamn work. Wow. Y'all do know your mother did this, right? My mother was wrong. Okay, she wrong. So let me tell you what y'all need to do. The three of you need to go upstairs and let her know just what she did was wrong. The three of you go and have a heart to heart. Go and let her know just your disdain and your disgust for what she's done. Go ahead. Oh, like you did when you gave her your heartwarming, heartbreaking rendition of why you got treated the way you did. Mm -hmm. She came here to feed her. God went and sent her to the rescue. And why wouldn't he? He sent me here to be her protector. Protection from what? From your mother being further black and blue on her legs from your brother over here. Mm-hmm. And... Shut up. And her wrist being black and blued and bruised. Shut up. With all hopes of him getting her to sign everything over to you three. You gonna put your hands on me? But with you being so greedy and not thinking, and that's why you forgot to feed her. Exactly. Mm -hmm. They said everyone thirsty doesn't need water. And all of you bonded to get me out of here. And Marie, I had every intention of letting you walk out of that door on your own. Uh-uh. Do you understand this? If you want to hurt her, you want to have to hurt me. You know you won't pay for what you did to my mother. Charleston, we need to talk. May I help you? Yes, I'm here me with Charleston. In reference to what? In reference to what I'm here with Charleston. Hold on. I got it, I got it, I got it. Hey, can Charleston, I come in? This is a really bad time. We're having a family meeting. Oh, oh, oh that makes a perfect time. What's she here for? Family meeting. There you go, thank you. Is this going to invite me? Good evening, family. My name is Benny, and... Your, your services are no longer needed. You already hired somebody? Benny, I'm sorry my brother wasted your time by having you come with what? That and so your brother didn't waste my time because your brother Charleston here, he owes me. Well, whatever it is that he owes you or whatever I'm, that I'm is. I'm sorry, I didn't get your name to know. Which sister are you again? It doesn't matter what my name is. Okay. What you need to understand is this young lady will be the one taking care of our mother. <laughs> Sister with no name. Get out of here. Anne Marie, right? Take care of my mother. Anne Marie, your time here is done. And oh. yeah, you've been considered to take care of our mother. But we Charleston, don't need you were given four payments, totaling eighty thousand dollars. We were supposed to help you pay for this house, buy into your mother's insurance policy, and Charleston. What is this individual we're talking about? Charleston. So now, the people have given you all that money. You all. And the money that I have now. You are beyond our backs. This is how we find out. You, you know what? I'm a boy. Who is this one? Cicely, isn't that house paid off already? Yes. It's a little too late to be having that conversation now, don't you think? Charleston, you wasn't supposed to go negotiate any type of money for this here house. Um, Benny, I think you should leave. No, 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 no. And I think that you all should reconsider how to handle this because there can be really, really bad repercussions. Look, we don't need no street problems in this address, okay? No, we don't. You know what? It's time for you to go. Are y'all sure that's how y'all want to deal with this? Yeah, yeah go ahead. Because once I pack this money up, yeah. it's you out of my hands. Leave, Benny. I don't know how you guys are gonna deal with Charleston, but I can tell you, it won't be nothing like the way the streets would deal with Charleston. Oh, you, you threatening my brother? Yo, William, let's let him go. Nothing compared to how the streets would deal with Charleston. You know, people in the world, funny about their money, especially when that money is promised with a return. Benny, it's time for you to leave. You gotta go. There's no way you can take care of my mother. <laughs> Get the fuck out. Yeah, listen. 
I was handpicked. Oh. And I have the same qualifications to take care of your mother. But I let you deal with Charleston. And on that note, family, I think I will leave. You know, I hope God comes in here and cleanses this place out. No, it's your heart. Because the sin of the devil is strong in here. Oh, wow. And I'm pretty sure he resides in here too. Oh, no, no. Your you got to Your ask. heart is dirty. Exactly. I thought, I thought I told you to go. No, no, no. You got to go. It's time for you to go. I'll see Thank you later, Charleston. Have a great night. It's time for you to go. What I was chosen. Was it the, it I was doesn't chosen. matter. I was chosen. Have a good night. You know what? We going to deal with you. I don't know what the hell you got us into, but we definitely going to have to deal with this. What the fuck was you thinking? What was that? Mommy. Shit. Sometimes, Sometimes, it tears my eyes to realize family ties turn into family lies when someone dies. Deceit comes in disguise as kin. But you and them are no longer playing on the same side of the fence. Separated by dollars and cents. Without a scent of love, I mean, not even a pinch Fake hugs with a stench Mama, damn, why'd you have to leave us like this? Kisses to the face, now turn to fists None of this makes any sense, I mean, where's the love? Brothers and sisters banging like bloods and cuz Cause they can't handle the pain of the loss And no words can explain just how much the same love is gonna cost